Most divorce cases start with people assuming assets are going to be divided equally, but that does not have to be the case at all. The conduct of the parties towards each other during their marriage can move those percentages, and I've seen them move quite dramatically in cases that have substantial misconduct. In a divorce, not all assets are the same. Retirement accounts need to be treated differently than real estate, and that needs to be treated differently than money that's sitting in a bank. And it's very important for the attorney to make those sorts of distinctions to make sure that the outcome is fair and appropriate. Higher volume attorneys just don't have the time to spend thinking about cases and really understanding what's going on in those particular cases. So a lot of times they'll miss the nuances. They won't have the creative thought and they just don't get the results for their clients that we're able to get because we have more time and more attention that we pay to each case. At the Claiborne Firm, we litigate the cases that matter the most.